Hi, preschool friend. Miss Julie here. I have one more book for you to go along with our vegetable theme the week we talk about vegetables. This one is called The Enormous Carrot by Vladimir Vagan. watering can and some kind of a rake and some seeds and a little frog. Hmm. What's going on in this page here? The sign says the carrot feast. And there's some animals over here and balloons. Some of the balloons are floating away. Early one spring, Daisy and Floyd planted seeds in their garden. What kind of animals are Daisy and Floyd? Can you tell? You see their big ears poking out of their hats and their whiskers and their teeth and their noses. They're bunny rabbits. They're planting seeds in their garden. Each day they watered and weeded. Everything grew exactly as they had planned. Here they are, they're watering a big patch of red tulips, reddish orange. These things are called hollyhocks. We've got all kinds of other beautiful flowers in their garden. Then, one morning, Daisy and Floyd discovered an enormous carrot growing in the middle of their garden. Here it is. You see the orange part? Here's the top of the carrot. Most of the orange part is underneath the ground. Oh, look, they're measuring the, how tall their sunflowers are. Sunflowers get really tall. Floyd is up there on the ladder. So they discovered this enormous carrot. This carrot is ready to pick, said Floyd. So Floyd tried to pull the carrot out of the ground, but the carrot stayed put. It wouldn't come out. I'll pull it out, said Daisy. Daisy tried to pull the carrot out of the ground, but the carrot stayed put. It would not come out. What are they going to do, do you think? Then Daisy and Floyd tried together to pull the carrot out of the ground. They tugged and they pulled and they tugged and they lugged, but the carrot stayed put. It wouldn't come out. Who else is in this picture here? Besides Floyd and Daisy, look over here. Someone else has come into our story. Just then, their friend Mabel came by. What kind of an animal is Mabel, do you think? Did you say cow? If you said cow, you're right. Mabel the cow. Will you help us pull this carrot out, asked Daisy. Naturally, said Mabel. That means, yes, I will. So Daisy, Floyd, and Mabel tried together to pull the enormous carrot out of the ground. They heaved and they hoed, but the carrot stayed put. It wouldn't come out. Now someone else is coming along in this picture, and here he is over here. Just then, their friend Henry came by. What kind of an animal do you think Henry is? He's got these horns, and he's got this long kind of a nose, and a beard, and hooves. Henry's a goat. <laughs> Will you help us pull this carrot out, asked Mabel. Glad to, said Henry. He's willing to help, too. So Daisy, Floyd, Mabel, and Henry tried together to pull the enormous carrot out of the ground. They grunted and they groaned. 
But the carrot stayed put. It wouldn't come out. Now who's this? Someone new in the in the story. Just then, their friend Gloria came by. Now Gloria, look at her closely. Gloria must be a chicken. Will you help us pull this carrot out? Asked Henry. Absolutely, said Gloria. That means, oh, for sure, I will help you. So Daisy, Floyd, Daisy, Floyd, Mabel, Henry, and Gloria tried together to pull the enormous carrot out of the ground. They teamed and they towed, but the carrot stayed put. It wouldn't come out. Just then, their friend Buster came by. Here's Buster. Oh, there he is up there. I think Buster, what kind of an animal is he? A dog, yes. Will you help us pull this carrot out, asked Gloria. Sure thing, said Buster. Buster has work to do, too. He's hauling big lumber, bunches of lumber. That's wood to build things. So, Daisy, Floyd, and Mabel, Henry, Gloria, and Buster tr tried together to pull the enormous carrot out of the ground. Look what they did with that lumber. They're trying, trying, trying. They stretched and they swayed, but the carrot stayed put. It wouldn't come out. Just then, their friend Claire came by. Will you help us pull this carrot out, asked Buster. I'd be delighted, said Claire. Claire the cat. So much good help. Can they do it? So Daisy, Floyd, Mabel, Henry, Gloria, Buster, and Claire tried together to pull the enormous carrot out of the ground. They hollered and they hauled. Claire the cat has brought the tractor. But the carrot stayed put. It wouldn't come out. Just then, their friend Lester came by. What kind of an animal is Lester? He's a mouse. <coughs> May I help you pull that carrot out? asked Lester. You're much too small, said Claire. Let me try, said Lester. Look, he's making muscles. Trying to make muscles. So, Daisy, Floyd, Mabel, Henry, Gloria, and Buster, Claire, and Lester tried together to pull the enormous carrot out of the ground. They tugged and they lugged. They heaved and they hoed. They grunted and they groaned. They teamed and they towed. They stretched and they swayed. They hollered and they hauled and... All at once, look what's happening. It's coming. It's coming out of the ground. All at once, the enormous carrot came out. Yippee! Everybody went flying. That happens sometimes. And then... Daisy, Floyd, Mabel, Henry, Gloria, Buster, Claire, Lester, and all their friends ate every bit of that enormous carrot until it was all gone. Carrot feast. That's what they're doing, having a big old carrot feast out in the beautiful, beautiful day, the sunshine. That afternoon, Daisy said, I can't wait to see what comes up tomorrow. Neither can I, said Floyd. But first, it's time for an enormous rest. What fun they're having with their garden, huh? Did you like that story? I like that story. That was the first time I'd ever read that story, and it was fun. Have a great day, friend. Bye.